It's a new bonus week in GTA Online. We're gonna try to make the most money we can this week, starting with a pretty fast money method. We're gonna go to the crate icon with the question mark on the map, and then it's gonna be in a different location each day, depending on when you're watching this. And then once you get to this area, we're gonna see like a circle on the map, which is basically where the space is gonna be. And we're trying to find a little package in this area. It's gonna be hidden somewhere here. It does beep as well, so try to listen to it. Once you get close, you will hear it beeping and there it is it's gonna look exactly like this it's just next to this bush once you see it go up to it press right on the d-pad and just like that we're gonna make a quick usually about twenty thousand dollars we also got ammo and snacks from that which is nice this time we just happened to get a lower amount but it's a nice quick money method it's very easy and straightforward so let's move on to the next one which is gonna be more of a serious one for this one we're gonna call up franklin you do need an agency to have franklin as a contact on your phone once you call him go to the second top option and request a payphone hit also i'll have the bonuses in the pinned comment this week so make sure to go check that out a little bit after you request it you'll see a blue telephone icon on the map go up to it press right d-pad to start it up and then we need to go and assassinate a target this is also a fairly quick one and we're gonna make a lot more money than the last one the assassination bonus is use a scoped rifle to take out the target with the bulldozer so we need to take out the target just like that so basically we waited for the target to walk in front of that bulldozer and then we shot the driver and then the driver killed him just like that it does say assassination bonus is complete as well so we executed that perfectly now we just have to leave the area and just like that we made $85,000 in under two minutes that might have been a record time personally for me to complete a payphone hit literally like a minute because most of it was just getting to the desert over there that was literally most of the time super super easy money method make sure you complete the bonus with it otherwise it's not going to give you nearly as much money let's move on to the next one which is going to be an even more serious one that's going to make us more money if you're in need of any gta modded accounts account boosts and cash make sure to check out hyper resupply down below in the description they offer some of the cheapest and safest cash and rank services out there on all platforms doesn't matter if you play on old gen or next gen and they have lots of verified reviews by their customers too and you can even use discount code hacky at checkout for an extra 10 percent off now let's get back into the video for this one we need to get the acid lab so make sure you have one let's go into services acid lab and then let's request it and then it's going to spawn somewhere near you now you do want to make sure you get supplies beforehand you can get supplies by either doing the stash houses which exactly like g's cash is going to be in a different location each day and then it looks like this on the map once you do that very fast and easy then it's going to resupply one of your businesses or you could just do a regular resupply mission with the acid lab so let's go in the back of it make sure the acid lab is outside as well if you go inside your acid lab inside of the freak shop then you can't actually start anything up so we don't have a whole lot of supplies anymore but we do have two bars of product which is worth over ninety thousand dollars we need to register as an mc we can either source supplies or sell the supplies which once again we're going to be doing the last part of this mission where we actually get the money let's press right d-pad to begin a sell mission then we're going to be on this motorcycle let's go to the drop off we are in a public session, so we might even get a bonus since technically we're doing this a bit riskier since people can technically grief us. I didn't really upgrade this motorcycle, which is actually an option, so I should probably do that for next time. In last week's money method video, we did get these supplies using the stash houses, so if you want to see how to do that, it's really easy. Yeah, this bike does not really like to turn when it's not upgraded. Stash the acid inside of the container, so let's go up to it, hold LT, and then let's throw it with RT looks like there's 10 drop-offs we have to do and there's a 20 minute timer but it's probably gonna take less than that and we basically just have to throw each one of these these drop-offs are all pretty close to each other so we don't have to drive too much let's see how much money we get at the end since it's technically worth over 90,000. but since we're doing it in a public we might get more money than that let's not throw it in the water though thank you that's number six number seven 
Number eight. Doing a wheelie with this bike is really easy. You can even turn while doing a wheelie. Oh crap, there's enemies? Why is there enemies in this one? What the heck? Looks like all of them aren't that easy, but it's just two enemies. We took them out. In about seven and a half minutes, we managed to complete this. That is delivery number 10. Now we just have to leave the area. Let's see what payout we're gonna end up getting at the end. And we got $136,000. So doing this in a public session might actually be worth it if it doesn't look that risky to you but $136,000 we made a good amount of money so far in this video we started off small we ended up big and of course the time trials are also great to do as always now click the video on screen now for the best SUVs currently in GTA online I hope you all enjoy that video and peace